Good evening, Jets Nation. Welcome to the Jude Jets show. The New York Jets extended defensive lineman John Franklin Myers this afternoon. That's why we signed John Franklin Myers to a four-year, $55 million contract. Franklin Myers is also getting paid $13.5 million this season. And I'm super glad the New York Jets signed up John Franklin Myers, who has had three sacks in our four games this season. I mean, outside of three sacks, he's also made huge contributions in the run game, applies pressure to quarterbacks basically every single play, and is paving way for are some of our defensive linemen like Quinn Williams, Phil Lerana Fadakusi, Shudden Rankins to get sacks and make big stops as well. Having a force like John Franklin Myers on the edge for the next four seasons along with Carl Lawson is going to be absolutely huge for the New York Jets and the contract we got for him is a steal. $13.5 million a season for a player who might end up better than Aaron Donald, probably not. But for a player who could end up on the same playing level as Aaron Donald, making Pro Bowls continuously, getting all pro nominations for only $13.5 million a season is an absolute steal. I mean, I'm telling you right now, if we waited to extend John Franklin Myers until the end of the offseason, he would have got more money than Carl Lawson. He would have got more money. There's no doubt about that. So I'm glad the New York Jets extended John Franklin Myers when we did and excited to have him on the team for the next four seasons. We also made some more moves today. So we released safety Gerard Wilson and then we later signed him back to the practice squad. Wilson actually started in yesterday's game, not yesterday's game, last week's game, had that crucial defensive pass interference call that kept Tennessee's drive alive, I believe, in the fourth quarter. Yes, in the fourth quarter. But that's not probably the reason we're releasing him. Ashton Davis and Sherrod Nelson are getting back up to full health. And while I did like how he played in that game, I thought, you know, he was playing his best, definitely for practice squad safety. Having him on the roster when we could make way for other players such as Blake Cashman, especially knowing that Hasman Azardine is going to be out of this game, just doesn't make much sense. So we did release Gerard Wilson, but there is a chance he could come back playing for us because he is on the practice squad. And Calvin Ridley and Russell Gage are not playing this week. So the New York Kids' chances of winning have got even better. Well, that's all I got for you guys today. If you ended up enjoying, let me know by hitting the subscribe and like button. The best way to grow my channel is by hitting those two buttons because the more buttons you press, the more YouTube recommends my videos to people who have never heard of the Jude Jets show. Also, comment down below if you think extending John Franklin Myers was a good idea. And then follow me on social medias, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at Jude underscore Jets for more content. And I'm your host, Jude, signing off for now. See you later. Peace.